IREX 2022, Japan's largest robot exhibition. IREX 2022 is one of the most extensive robot trade shows globally, where robot manufacturers from Japan and the world exhibited the latest and incredible technologies, providing an ideal business opportunity for manufacturers and companies. From attractive humanoid and bio-inspired robots to several industrial robots, all were a part of this big site trade show in Tokyo. Stay with us till the end as we will discuss some remarkable robots exhibited in IREX 2022. Bex Robot Kawasaki presents a goat-shaped robot known as Bex, named and modeled after a wild goat, Ibex. It's a four-legged rideable robot with wheels and can carry a human being up to 220 pounds on its back. The handlebars on the robot goat are used to control the ride. Further to its passenger carrying back, the robot can also be used to carry crops on farmland and on a construction site to transport materials. The head of the Bex is customized and could be replaced with other suitable alternatives. However, it's still unclear whether the robot was only a demonstration or planned to be sold to customers. Kaleido Robot Kawasaki showcased another unique creation known as Kaleido at an international robot exhibition in Tokyo. Weighing 85 kilograms and 184 centimeters tall, the aim of designing this humanoid robot is to assist in search and rescue missions in disaster areas as it can lift humans and heavy objects during emergencies. Kaleido's walking speed is 4 kilometers an hour with its human-like movements. The robot is considered stronger than humans, which can lift 60 kilograms. It can stand on straight legs as well as half-bent legs and is able to adapt to unstable conditions. Friends Robot After Kaleido, Kawasaki introduced its more miniature version of robot known as Friends, which is more compact as it is made to work in narrow spaces. It's a humanoid robot with eyes on its face. Weighing 55 kilograms and 160 centimeters tall, Friends Robot runs on batteries with a walking speed of 3 kilometers an hour. It can lift up to 10 kilograms and is designed for entertainment, personal care, and to meet needs for assistance in hospitals and nursing homes. Neoki Robot Neoki is a service robot that has a digital face with a flat screen, a long arm, and a neck with a vacuum cleaner on its base. It can move around like a human, performing different tasks with its arms. The service robot brings meals to customers in restaurants, delivers packages, and carries medicines and luggage. Neoki has a light and visionary sensor to understand and see around its environment. The robot can be taught new skills and movements to operate in an environment using a remote control system. Metacaroid Hinatori Metacaroid Hinatori is a joint invention by Kawasaki and Sysmex Corporation. It is the first made-in-Japan robotic-assisted surgery system capable of performing operations with great accuracy. This robotic system consists of three mechanisms. The primary one is the surgeon cockpit. The cockpit is designed to fit surgeons' postures during operations and supports stress-free surgeries. The second mechanism is known as the vision unit, which promotes smooth communication between surgeons and assistants by providing 3D images of the surgeon's cockpit viewer. The third component of this robotic system is the operation unit, which consists of arms that are as compact as human arms. These arms perform similar movements to human arms and support smoother surgeries by reducing interferences between an arm and an assistant. There are around 400 robotic systems currently in Japan, and due to their compact size, they will become more common in the future, not just in Japan, but globally. Kinon Robotics the world's leading service robotics company, Kenon Robotics, presents its new and compact delivery robots in IREX 2022. These AI-powered, lightweight robots serve as an assistant in hotels and restaurants while increasing employees' productivity and enabling them to achieve automation. 
The robot can easily steer through narrow spaces due to its centimeter-level positioning system. It supports seamless delivery as well as exceptional dish-serving services and can reduce response times by communicating with other units. These robots have auto-charging features making them an ideal assistant in the restaurant business. Agrist A Japanese company known as Agrist showcased its farm robots at the biggest trade fair that aims to solve problems in agricultural harvesting, such as labor shortage, etc. The harvesting robot weighs 16 kilograms and can operate for four hours on a single battery charge. These harvest robots can cut off bell peppers at the speed of 28 seconds in a 180 degree direction and cut off extra stems simultaneously. The robot easily moves on a wire, due to which it can move past the leaves and mud on the ground. These harvest robots aim to boost harvest yields by 20%. Mobile Gripper Robot A mobile gripper developed by Tokyo Robotics is a robot made for short-distance delivery, transporting goods on a pallet in logistics facilities and manufacturing sites, especially cardboard boxes of various sizes, without damaging them. The robot can draw objects from the floor or from a height of about 160 centimeters and moves by means of marking or lines on the floor while free navigation is planned for the future using SLAM technology. It has a moving trolley attached to its base, which helps in making small turns, making it suitable to operate in narrow places. HRP-4 Robot Developed by Kawada Industries, the HRP-4 robot is lighter and slimmer than the previous HRP series. Weighing only 86 pounds, the robot can stand on one leg, recognize objects and human faces, and respond to voice commands by striking a pose. With a height of 5 feet and 34 moving joints, each arm can lift up to one pound of load. The humanoid robot is used mainly for advertising and to cooperate with humans. Forpheus Robot Introduced by Omron Corporation, Forpheus is a table tennis robot that measures the opponent player's facial expressions, body movements, and heart rate. The robot is also capable of assessing its own performance as well as determining the speed of the racket. The Forpheus is extremely precise and never loses. The robot was designed to represent Omron's future vision where humans and machines are in coordination. Overall, the exhibition was a vehicle to let the world know about future robot technologies, where companies worldwide exchanged business talks and the latest innovations. That's it for today. Let us know what you think of the latest exhibits of IREX 2022 in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel. See you soon.